go. Thank you. All right. Yeah. What's up, everyone, and welcome back to the Philippines. So we arrived to Taklaban last night. Woo! And Tal has actually a few hookups around these areas. So Taklaban is north of Leyte. And while we're going to be here for like the next week, we're going to explore a bit of Leyte, we're going to explore a bit of Samar. And at the moment, we got these two fellas right here. So we got JR Woo! and we got Matt. So they're going to show us around Taklaban. And what area are we in right now? Palo. We're in Palo. We're in Palo. And we're going to go do a hike and get an awesome view of whole Taklaban. So let's go see what this place has to offer. Okay, so plans have changed just a little bit, so we met up with one of the guys who picked us up from the airport last night, and we're just gonna have lunch first, and then we're gonna go hike that mountain up there to get the viewpoint. So, let's eat. Right, it has been a long and well needed time, but we have been brought to some coconuts again. So Tal and I haven't had coconuts in like weeks. Like when we were in Sri Lanka, we bought our own coconut knife because every single day we're having a coconut. And these ones here are different though. So in Sri Lanka they had the king coconuts. These are called buko, buko juice. Like these are green coconuts, they're a lot bigger. They're huge, they're massive in size, but I. I don't know how much juice is in them. They just have a really thick shell. So it's finally time to be reunited with our delicious coconuts. What do you think compared to like the Sri Lankan coconuts? It's different. It's different than Sri Lankan coconuts. It's definitely more of like a mild flavor. Yeah. But it's really good. It's right. definitely delicious. Let's see what it's like. Let's see how this compares mm. to the Sri Lankan coconuts. Whoa. Is mine off? Is it off? <laughs> Mine's good. Yeah. I think I got an off coconut. Try mine? Yeah, mine definitely tastes funky. Yeah, my coconut is off. <laughs> <laughs> this is way better. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good first coconut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna my, keep my coconut. <laughs> my, I want another one. That oh. is like fermenting. Ugh. That's not good. That's a sour coconut. <laughs> Coconut number two, we'll see how this one tastes. <laughs> the first one was definitely a dud. Oh yeah, that's way better. Mm. Much better. It's, I feel like king coconuts are definitely better. Like, these ones aren't as sweet, but they're still refreshing. These ones aren't as sweet, but they taste like creamier. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah. Yeah, it sort of does in a way. And as always, when we finish drinking the coconut, you can slice it open. Then we got all the coconut meat inside. These coconuts definitely have way more meat than the shrunken coconuts. Like, look how thick that is. Look at all that meat. So we use this little cut off coconut piece to scrape it out. Oh, this is, <laughs> I think mine's too thick. Look at that. Ow, I've never had a coconut this thick before. It's so chunky. It just breaks off into a giant chunk. Hmm. 
definitely doesn't have has as much flavour, but we'll try. <laughs> but for sure, most meat I've ever seen on a coconut to drink. Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh, that's good. Mm. We are not a sweet, huh? It's creamy though. Really creamy. All right, next destination. Here we go. So that mountain that I showed you previously, this is it right now. So we're just climbing to the very top. It's around 600 steps. And this is this is like the stairway to heaven, Tuklaban edition. <laughs> I think we're gonna have a pretty good view though. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. made it to the top. It wasn't exactly the hardest hike. It's just an extremely hot day. But look at this. We got a 360 view of the whole of Tuklaban. We just, we can see everything actually from up here. Hell yeah, boy, we made it to the top. Oh the yeah, man. That's how you do it. <laughs> it was so sweaty right now. <laughs> what a view. transportation around here is the trike. <laughs> you can fit as many people as you can in these things. At the moment we got seven. We're just sitting on the side. Comfortable in there, man? Not really. <laughs> Look at all these people. It is packed. night what a day here in Tuklevan so we ended up just eating at a few like food stalls they, there was one area where they had a bunch of food stalls we could pick what we want it was so amazing and we ended up meeting up with another group of people that so actually I need Tal to explain it because we've been meeting up with so many people today <laughs> like I don't even know what the plans have been so what, what, who are these people that we've been meeting up with? So, the, all of this is being organized by a friend of mine. She's actually one of my viewers for my YouTube channel. Her name's Rachel. Shout out to Rachel from Long Beach, California. I stayed at her place when I was in California a little while ago. She's a Filipina living in the United States of America. And I basically let her know that we were coming here and she basically set all of this up with a bunch of people that we don't know to take us around somewhere like that and help us out. So. It's been the most amazing experience because strangers keep coming up to us and keep picking us up and taking us places and not letting us pay for anything. And they're like, hey, we'll take you here, we'll take you there, you can stay here, you can stay there. So it's been really, really good. See, I've never even met Rachel and I love her because she has just given us so many opportunities. And it's like around where we are, not this is a place where not many tourists come to. So summer and Leyte, like really, this is not a place tourists visit. So we're trying to put it on the maps, we're trying to get people to come to these places, we're trying to show everyone that there's some amazing places to visit around these islands. Um, and we're going to be here for the next week, so be sure to follow the journeys because I'll probably be doing a video every day while I'm here. Um, and tomorrow, we're just going to play it as we go, we've got some exciting journeys tomorrow. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this adventure. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to this guy, Travelling Clut. Follow your journey to skate your comfort zone, and I'll see you later. Bye!